Okay, so partially due to obligation, we're doing this, even though this is probably going to be one of the shortest lists ever. Here are the five worst episodes of season five of Supernatural. Number five, doesn't exist. Number four, doesn't exist either. Number three. Okay, maybe. Fallen Idols. Fallen Idols is... All right, I guess in comparison to the overall very heavily connected majority of the stories that happen in the rest of the season, this very much filler episode does kind of derail the whole connectivity with the rest of the season, but only in story aspect, not in character development, because this is the episode where Dean trusts Sam again. This is the one where they reconnect and Sam is the one who realizes what's actually going on faster than Dean. And it also includes them fighting Paris Hilton. Funny enough, when people think of this episode of this season, a lot of people think it's the worst one, but it's not. It's just nowhere near as good as all the others. Doesn't mean it's a bad episode, just means it's quite low in the overwhelmingly majority positive episodes of this season. Number two. 99 Problems. My first and main problem with 99 Problems is that it is a retread of Good God, y'all. Sure, it does have a few tweaks here and there with the whole Horror of Babylon idea, but in the end, it is a hidden inside source that is influencing the town to essentially turn on each other in the idea of something that is leading towards the apocalypse and the end of the world. And pretty much the only reason why this episode didn't get a negative rating from me is because Castiel and his humor literally raise this episode out of negativity. The comedic timing of his character in this episode is perfectly written. All of the jokes land, and they still land. And while I do find that this episode is quite derivative, the final five minutes are quite meaningful with Dean going to talk to Lisa, pretty much kind of setting up the idea that he is going to in fact say yes to Michael because he is so lost. So I like that aspect of this episode, but I can't really say that I like an episode for comedic jokes and for a final five minute and piece of importance. So that is why it is number two on the list. And now number one, Swap Meat. Swap Meat sucks. Sure, it's kind of a juvenilely funny idea, and if this episode had happened, say, earlier on in the show, like maybe season three or... Heck, I could have almost said it could have landed in season four and it would have been better. Really, this episode is so derivative, nothing happens in this episode. You've got a decent performance from a Grey's Anatomy alumni, and then you have Sam walking around in funny teenager kid outfits. But aside from that, this episode does not have anywhere near as much importance in the overall narrative, neither with character development as it should. It does use some pretty cheap but yet ingenious visual storytelling to kind of help you place these characters where they are, with Sam wearing the kid's clothes and the kid wearing Sam's clothes. But that's it. Probably the greatest crime of this episode is that if you skipped it, you wouldn't miss out on anything. You literally would not miss out on a single aspect that this season had. But that's it, that is the very short and done. There is no honorable mentions, there is nothing else. I can really only say there are three bad episodes of this season. One was a stretch, one was a reach, and one is actually really bad. It's, it's not a good episode, I don't like Swap Me. But that's it guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was short, but next week we will be talking about the five best episodes of Supernatural Season 5, and I still am arguing with myself to this day. I've been arguing about it for like the last two months. I haven't actually recorded it yet. I'm not kidding, it's actually been that much of a challenge. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, and if you're interested in more, subscribe. Make sure to tune in next Thursday to see the top five best episodes of Supernatural Season 5, as well as my last Supernatural video for a little while. I'm taking a little break before I start Season 6. Anyways, until then, see you guys next time.